Hey guys, it's got Gold here bringing you another goal making guide. Unlike my other videos, this video will be covering an area in which 6.2 takes place in. The area and location we're looking for is called Stone Crag Gorge within the Grand in the area I'm highlighting on the map. Mobs here are very easy to farm, especially since you get a battle mount while leveling up from 95 to 100. The amount of gear you might need here is around normal slash heroic dungeon level gear. The only thing you must watch out for with these mobs is the Talbux charge and the Elix slam. But once you get to around item level 660, 670, you usually can down the whole pack with one or two AoEs so they don't even get to perform their disable. And also guys, I've been seeing a lot of gold making guides saying making 20k, 30k an hour. There's no possible way that can happen unless you get a world drop or you get one of the transbog pieces of gear that also is pretty much considered a world drop. Seeing to it as it's usually a 0.1 or 0 0.00001 drop chance. That was just a random disclaimer I wanted to give you guys just so you guys don't fall into the trap of trying to actually farm that area for 20 minutes, 40 minutes, or an hour and finding out that you're only getting 1 to 2k from each area that you farm. But you know what guys, I'm not going to go into it that much. I'm going to leave that to people like Asmongold to make informational videos on that. Well, with all that being said, let's get into the gold making. Hey guys, I'm back from my 20 minute farm and we got lucky this time. We got some uh, parts from the auction house module that you can also use to turn in at your garrison's trading post to upgrade to level 3. All three of the parts are needed to complete the daily that is required to upgrade it. Or you could take the route that I go and just sell it to people on the AH that are either too busy, raiding, PvPing, or just simply too lazy to go out and do it themselves. But before I go guys, I'm going to let you guys know what to do with the hardy suit bones. There's an NPC called Meat Gut that resides within the Grand, in which a location I'll share in the description below that you have to turn into. He accepts 20 bones for 7 gold, so each time you turn it in, you'll be receiving 7 gold. And the, the daily is also repeatable, so keep doing it until you actually give him all of them. Well guys, I think that about sums everything up that we needed to go over in this gold guide. And also I made sure to include everything that could maximize your profit towards the end tenfold. Thank you guys for watching and make sure to check out my other videos and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys and later.